Welcome back, everybody. This is our third and final round for the evening. My opponent here won the die roll. I've lost all of them. <laughs> so he's on Good. the play. Yep. All right, we're going to start with a... Yeah, we're just going to start with a Flames and Passer. Hmm. Let's start with a Tap Blood Crypt. Last turn. Right. Turn. Uh, start 25, not 12. <laughs> we'll go with uh, Mutable. Mm -hmm. Pay two. Thalia, Guardian of, Thra Guardian of Thraben. Cool. Last turn. the tax or play a creature. I'm going to play Dwarven Forge Chapter. Yeah. One, three. Prowess and War Pay 2. Okay. Uh, we're going to play a Ship of Dooms as a land return. Uh, we're going to tap two mana for a Thalia's Lieutenant. Uh, ETB trigger. Mm -hmm. Put a 1-1 one, one on Thalia. Uh, go ahead and swing three first strike. 17. And pass her. Let's go ahead and push that. Yeah. Up. yeah. Oh, sorry, two white and a colorless. Yes. Um, and play Adeline, Resplendent mm -hmm. Cathar. Uh, ETB, gets a one more time. Uh, go to combat, swing two, which is going to trigger to make a human, which will ETB trigger. So you will take uh, four. Go to 13. And uh, just as a sake of, I know we can count as well, but easy reference, she's currently at three power. Pass mm -hmm. one. There, so it's away from the um, life total. Dreadbore. What did she do to you? Punched me in the face? No, she didn't. He did. <laughs> she caused that, though. A <laughs> uh, little Dreadbore, the lieutenant. Are you well. sure you didn't want to do with this human? Yes. Okay. Attack for three. Oh, okay, I will take three. You ever realize you're just an idiot? Um, I will play Immutable. I will tap one, make Mutable a creature, mm -hmm. swing three. Ten. Pass her. A basic. Do you have any left? Nice. There's four. Four total, so you have you have almost all of them? Yep. I have one more. So the next Fable Passage isn't necessarily dead. Okay. Unless I draw the basic, then the passage. So you must get Oh my is the sack my half dead. Yeah. It's a 3 3 menace lifelink, ward, pay life, life equal to its power. power. Yep. Okay. Uh, I will pass turn.
Chandra. Go up. Domia for two. Dauntless Bodyguard. Mm -hmm. um, for the sake of it, targeting the, the human. same token. Okay. Um, She's at five. Mm -hmm. Pass her. Another tenacious D. Yeah. Pass. Okay. Land for turn. Um, I. Yes. I'm so afraid I want to take, but I have to deal with it. I'm going to pay one. Um, oh no, he is sorry. He is an artifact, isn't he? No, he's an artifact, but as a prototype, he is a black. Okay, artifact. good, 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 good. Yeah. Uh, so pay brave one. The elements is brave. The yeah. elements on black. I am plunging all my white creatures at Chandra. Is a total of five damage. This does not have a bodyguard on it, correct? Correct. Okay, we'll block there. Yep. So she'll take three, yep. correct? Yep. Three. Die. My pun. Oh. You, I would have built Frankie from killing my creature. So then, yeah. Anyways, uh, that will be my turn, Pastor. I wondered if you had it, and I assumed you didn't when you did it. Uh, I, I had a brain fart. Yeah. Um, oh. This is my brain fart. I thought she was still in the field. Oh, I gotcha. Yeah. Um... Cast the dread boar on. Cool, cool. You're, you're gonna get this game here. I can't stop you. Uh, play another tenacious D. Um, yeah, I don't really want you to double block them. No blades. You use two. Go ahead. I just went off Chandra. Yeah, you got it. I got another brain. Uh, what? I, I, well, <laughs> like, like you can't draw another brain. Yeah, you in, can. In the creature, in, in a creature aggro deck. Yeah. To hit zero creatures on any of your top decks is pretty rough. Sorry, hit only dotless bodyguards is pretty rough. Yeah. Let's see what we got. That's what you want on turn one, not turn six. I guess you want on turn two, but. Like I said, the, the big thing was just forgetting I had. Though I literally kept the chef at Dunes open to pay the one life if I needed to. Yeah. And I just like let it resolve, and I still thought the owner would let me go. Okay, Part of me, I was like, do I cast... I, I should have actually played it on the Thalia's Lieutenant first, in case you did, like, yeah. baited out the brave the elements. So you'd have another one for next turn for... Yeah. But when you didn't, I assume you just didn't have it yet. And I assume there's four in here, of course. It really should be. I don't usually play creature decks, so I like, felt weird attacking her. Oh, we're not playing. We're okay. between games. Oh, Ola Citadel with an X spell. Can you uh, X is zero. With, uh, I can't pay more life. You can't pay more life. Cool. You can't All pay right. any additional costs with it. Uh, Ola, I, correct? Yeah. Ola Citadel? Correct. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. That would have been a really sick combo. It would be stupid broke if you could pay a life for it, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Got it. So, 
a life gain dex would be ridiculous. It's three. Five math is bad. Oh, yeah, so I missed one. That I have one more come to. Oh yeah, you, this is the game you mulligan. Let's hope I don't do it dumb again. Kind of felt like it was atta like attacking was a mistake, especially when you had the Adeline as the follow up. But for me, yeah, uh, uh, me attacking, okay, yeah. me attacking. You, if you would know it was in my hand, and I would see when I was top decking, you would have done. If you would have attacked me, I would have been overwhelmed in the end. Yeah, but oh, and until when I have the Chandra that you can't get through to, like I might as well yeah, just yeah. play defense and let her do the right. Work. Once you play the Chandra, but uh, before then, like, I would have definitely done a Brave the Elements to oh, yeah. do the. I'll let you take both. I, I would have let you take both Nudibolts. Yeah. Um, to trade for both your creatures, but I would have protected one of my Dauntless Bodyguards <laughs> or the human with the Brave the Elements, probably. Yeah. Just for the creature advantage to try and then get back on board. But I mean, my top decks are so awful. Yeah. <laughs> I'll bend the play. Yep. I don't know what it should be. Uh, <laughs> it should, should be, be losing. to a hopeful initiate. Fast turn. Haunted Ridge, your turn. We have a turn, and we're going to go ahead and play two, and we're going to play our friend Thalia again. Mm -hmm. Go to combat, swing one. Fast turn. YouTube. I did it on my turn <laughs> so that he couldn't untap and brave the elements. Okay, so instead we're gonna tap two and Valia? Yep. Pass, I'm sorry, pass, attack you yeah. one, then pass turn. Yep. will say, you're a terrible player. You're supposed to play instance on your opponent's turn. Yes, give them the opportunity to kind of yeah, spread the yeah, elements. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. Tap three. Re... Well, not replay. Adeline. Re Adeline. Yep. Go to combat. Yep. Swing. Trigger. And that'll be two. Two. Sixteen. Uh, and pass turn. And for the camera, yep. there's three. Three trigger.
One, two, one, one. Yeah. Me hook for two. Uh, okay, so these black, two die. Black, two. Yep. Uh, you have two creatures die, so I will lose, or gain two life. Yes. Eighteen. I'll pass. pass. Uh, and then it's just a static. Whenever uh, creature I die, I lose, and you gain one life. Oh, yeah. And whenever one of mine dies, you lose a life. Oh, whenever you. So yours, yeah, whoever right. has a creature die, the other one has a bad yeah, thing yeah. happen. Yeah. Well, uh, a, ba- a a change because you get a, ga- a benefit. Right, so yeah, if, if I get, yours yeah. dies, a bad thing happens. <laughs> no matter what dies, a bad thing happens for me. Yes. Uh, draw for turn. Yeah. Um, uh, next just on a turn, so we're going to go ahead and tap three. Uh, I'm going to play my friend, the Extraction Specialist. Got a reader. Yeah. Lifelink, when she ETBs, I can choose a creature card in my graveyard with uh, Converted Man cost two or less, and return it to the battlefield. Uh, and as long as can. she uh, is on the field, it can't attack or block. Cool. So we're going to go ahead and grab one of our Thalia's back. Okay. Uh, that puts our creature count back to three. Uh, go to combat, swing Adeline and the human at you. That will put this up to four. Go to 13. And then nope. I will pass her. Shield you do again? Four or five death touch. If you draw a card, you lose two life. If I draw a card, I gain two life. Okay. Then I'll pass. Okay. So. 18. Oh, yeah. Yep. Turn. Right. And she does have death touch. Okay. Uh, four or five. Plans return. They don't trade. They would trade right now. So mathematically, I think this is the play. Wedding announcement. Oh boy. Yeah. So we're gonna go to combat, mm-hmm. and we're gonna swing with everything. Trigger, dropping a well, this was yep. a second human. This is gonna bring us up to five. Uh, oh, sorry. I should have to tap tap one more non creature spells. Yep. So no no man open for breaking elements. Wouldn't have been even with one anyways. True, because... Uh, let's see. It's a 3-2, correct? Yeah, 3-2 lifelink, two one ones, and a 5-4. Block there. Okay. Take 7. Uh, yes, and I will gain 3. Go to 6. Go to 21. And Thalia is now active and able to attack and block. Yep. Uh, I will go to end step. Uh, and so you have a creature die, so I gain Yes. Uh, trigger. Uh, I attack with two or more creatures this turn. I will draw a card and lose two more life. Yeah, 19. Yeah. Uh, and pass turn. Can you do it? Chanter. Yeah. We'll play the Bone Crusher. Okay. And. Pass. Drop again. <laughs> Three mana. Brutal Cath. Oh, sorry, I was too late to my draw. Yeah. Um, we're going to exile. Uh, your shield rid there until Brutal Cathar leaves the field. Um, that is now at five. Go to combat. Mm-hmm. Four, three, one, three. Mathematically, does anything make sense? I don't think it does. Not. Terrible. Drawing doesn't hurt me at the moment, though. So, go to combat. Mm-hmm. 
swing two citizens. Uh, sorry, swing one citizen to create a second citizen. Sure. A human yeah. to have yeah. um, two swinging at you. So I have one here, and then yeah. I'm going to block the two that are attacked. That's what I figured. So uh, she will go down one. Uh, I'll however, have one left, and I'll go to eleven from creatures dying. Oh, that's me. Okay. Uh, and then my end step, I will up this and draw a card. No, you won't. What? I attacked with two more creatures. Um, that was never declared as an attacker. It just it's came in attacking, correct? So it's not attacking with so, two creatures? Correct. It, it was never declared as an attacker. Interesting. Okay. Uh, well, then now on turn. Yep. Uh, so get the... Oh, sorry. I so get you get a 1-1. One, one. Yes, I get another yep. one. you discard a card. Okay. Each opponent who didn't discard a non-land card loses three life. Discard a seal away? Lieutenant. Mm -hmm. uh, ETB trigger. Counter. Counter. And now um, it's two with two 1-1 one, one counters yep. and a 1-1 one, one counter. Uh, I'm going to hurt him back just for the minutes. Go to combat. Mm -hmm. He's a 3-3, three, three, you a 4-3. I don't like that trade, so he's going to hang back. But everybody else is going to go ahead and swing. She does tap. So, um, triggers. First trigger is he gets a 1-1 one, one counter because it's a second. Another civilian mm -hmm. or citizen, human, I'm calling their actual token names, um, and ETBs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Is that seven? So she is now a uh, eight, uh, five. And three, two, first strike. I should have done the map. I made it lethal. So there's four here, five here. No, we're going to go. Um, so yeah, five. Uh, That's eight. Eight total. Yes, eight total. Uh, that is not on the add line. Block there. Uh, we will hit the bone pressure with damage for. Well, I guess it doesn't matter. It's they're they're going to kill both. Gonna yeah, yep, yep. yeah. So you're going to lose two life. I'm going to gain one life. From that exchange. Yep. And then I'm gonna take eight. Yes. So go to four. Uh, now end step. We will now get yeah. wedding invitation. Wait on, but I put an invitation counter. I did tack this time, so we will yep. draw the card. But more importantly, it now has three or more wedding invitation counters on it, and it will flip, and I will get that nice anthem effect. Wedding festivity. Creatures that control. Let's see what are my outs here. I'm not sure, but. I think my best play is to draw a card and lose two life using castle. Maybe just ends up being hope for another me hook masker and tap it all out. Yeah. It's either that or extinction event, I think, but I don't think four. that works because you still have something. I think four is what you need to. I played Thalia's lieutenant. Yes, I think four of uh, a me hook clears it. Takanuma. Mm -hmm. I'm going out on my own terms. Yeah, I like it. Activate castle, lose three life. Game three. I'll, 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 be, I'll be honest, my favorite way to lose a game is to play a shock land untapped. Yeah. Like, you can you know do what? it at two, you can't do it at one. Don't forget your children. Yeah. Didn't punt that time. 
didn't see any brave elements. God, I, was I for one. kept drawing lands there. Yeah, yeah I I felt like you were missing something. I'm like I yeah. I don't know. I was what missing it is. spells as it turns I, out. I, I just thought it was removal. I'm like he's missing something. I'm gonna hope that I can just get yeah. through because I was missing. I had to hit brave the elements anywhere in the last like three turns. I would just end it. Yeah. Um, I was sitting there at Thali's lieutenant, just like. I, I just need that big explosive turn with a Brave the Elements to end this. But. This isn't very good. Oh, I have some coins. Is there anything else? Oh, I should work with the flowers. Actually, you know what? I just get the feeling that you probably will never actually attack with that shield or no reason to it ends exactly. the game on its own <laughs> yeah it's one of those things where I'm like you know what you, you mentioned that Chandra I'm like you're not going to attack into me for anything seal away is do nothing oh yeah they don't hit shield rune. I'm gonna be on the play this time I'm looking at Liliana the Veil, and I'm like, he's just going to sack a 1-1 citizen. <laughs> it's not a great trade there. So I, I'm a big fan of your hands as an MTG artist, and so I, there's the citizens, but there's... I just love the art because it's funnier for somebody to get beat in the face with, you know, yeah. somebody with a watering can in their hand. A watering can makes a good weapon, those old metal ones. Yeah, I think it's the one she has. She's got a bird on her shoulder, too. Even number of piles. Because then 60 always hits there. Oh. And oh you, okay, I see what you're saying. I yeah. think statistically, having it in multiples of four with play sets of cards, yeah. it's a bad idea. Oh. So I do an odd number for that reason. That's fair. And I, I kind of like prime numbers myself. I don't like I, three, I don't, seven, five. See, I, I pile them, and then I shuffle each pile, and then I shuffle the piles together, and so that makes why it's even. But with what you did, that makes a lot of sense. No, I don't know. All right, here we go. If we get foul, yeah. In hand with, like, three lands, four removal spells. No. <laughs> three lands and extraction specials. <laughs> Good luck. Let's hope for no Mulligans. You too. I'm a, I can accept losing. Yeah, I mean, I, I'm surprised I haven't given you a no-lander yet tonight. That's normally, like, one of my... Uh, Although, I suppose if you're curving at three, you probably aren't running, like, 19 or 20 lands. You're probably on a few more. It's a single land. It's not going to work for me. What if I raise you with five lamps in an aggro deck? Like I said, I clump them. Hey. But I can't control whose deck I clump them in. <laughs> Here's my thing. If, we're, if somebody's molding, I'm happier as both. It, it, I always just love, I hate winning when it's like, yeah. I had seven in my face opening. I'm an aggro deck. I had seven in my opening hand. My opponent milled down, or, uh, uh, Mulligan down to five. Yeah. I just had card advantage. There was a... Uh, video a few weeks ago I was playing and it was game three and yeah. I think I mulliganed to like five or maybe four and I ended up drawing eight lands and oh. five spells and one of the comments was like the better player won like I literally had five spells it, <laughs> skill has nothing to do with what, that what I am thinking is they probably were making a comment based on you should have kept an earlier hand maybe like you yeah. you, you clearly over mulliganed you were too greedy but no my and if I Depends on who I'm playing, of course. If I have a heavy, a, a land heavy hand and I'm playing against a slow deck, I'll keep it. But if I have a hand against an aggro deck and there's zero removal spells, you're not keeping that. Yeah. And I don't remember who it was even against. It was probably, oh, it was against like a Metalwork Colossus deck. Yeah. And he, he had two mystical disputes and I had, you know, blue spells. So like he had curve advantage counter spells against my spells. Um, I'll keep. I will as well. Alright, I'm gonna start on Bloodhurt. Your turn. Drop 
for turn. Lands for turn. Hopeful initiate for turn. Pass the turn. Curveball here and do a second, a different turn two play. Not failure. Lumar Gas. Oh, I hate that one too. Yeah, everyone hates it. Um, yep. Go to combat. Go to yeah. team. I want one on him. Hate you for two. I can only assume it goes there. Yeah. Turn. It, I've been doing the math both ways. Technically, I think it is better to put it on the aspirant first because then it'll always keep going up. Yeah. But let's foil drift by the aspirant. Yes, that came in untapped because Fatal Passage counts as a land. Oh, yeah. I thought YouTube, it was, I thought they'll, it was a, they'll comment the weirdest stuff. I thought it was the basic thing, so. Yeah. All right, draw for turn. Uh, land for turn. Tap two. Play. Thought it was Lieutenant. Put this to two. Combat swings. Put this thing in the ice. I think I'm forced to use this, even though I don't want to hit the deck yet. Yes. We all get swamps. All your removal is in black, so we're called black. Okay. Checks out. Um, you could have burn spells, I mean. I could have a, a stop, but, yeah. I, but I don't. That's true, you do um, something in the deck. Pass. I was expecting pushes, so. That too. Draw for turn. It's also in there. I just don't see them. Yeah. Uh, land for turn. Mm -hmm. uh, we will go to combat and swing uh, four, yeah. Go to level. Yep. And pass turn. Four mana, nothing to do. Yeah, top decks have been fun. Yeah. Um, let's. Let's try it again. Yep. Walk again. Uh, pass. I know you're always supposed to. Oh, that helps actually quite a bit. Never mind. Um, Castle Iron Veil? Oh, God. Yeah, that, that's a thing. <laughs> Create a human? Yep. I, I was going to talk about how I was top decking a bunch of lands, and then you get that land. Uh, go to combat for five. Go to six. Fast turn. Yeah, Iron Veil is a real good card. This is actually the first time I've gotten to use it uh, to make humans. I just realized if I do do the soldier change on this, this comes out. That's a 3 4. Oh, uh, yeah. 3 4 and a 2 2. Let's push that. Okay. Okay. Not really what I want to do, but. And then <laughs> prototype that. Pass. Okay. You need to have like for turn. better things. Than these. I can't pick them up. They're like too small. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm in an aggro deck. So what better deck to try and get a bit more greedy in? Uh, I am going to create another mm -hmm. human. Make it bigger. Make him bigger. Mm -hmm. Okay. One. And play Kier Keithian. And make him bigger again. Uh, and we'll go to combat and swing with a 4-4. Four, four. I don't want to go lower, so... Understand. Block and... White flink. Yep. I don't like you having blockers, so I'm happy. Pass turn. And uh, I am hellbent. Yep. And the name's 0 2 four.
Oh, even. Okay, yeah. 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 I, I, my first thing was technically it's not even, but then I read it's like it counts for that. Yeah. Uh, pass. Okay. Yeah, I, I say it that way so that I don't say something's dumb like odd. <laughs> oh wait, yeah. no, I meant even. I like this top deck. Um, I won't be making a human this turn. Oh. I don't the mana. I, I didn't. Oh, the top deck a wasn't a land. It is, but not the countering card. It's this oh, countering card. Oh, the lieutenant. The gotcha. lieutenant, yeah. So put a counter on him, hit you for three. Pass turn. <laughs> Well, the good news is you stopped Kithian from turning into Gideon. Top deck brave the elements. That's, that's really, if I top like, deck brave the elements. Put you to 18. Let's, let's see. It is not a brave the elements. <laughs> it is a human. I mean, if it's a creature, I'm assuming it's a human. Uh, oh god, yep. So, trigger. Mm -hmm. He is now a 2 2. <laughs> She's 4. 4 5. Right, right. I, I, yeah. Sorry, yeah, five. Um, <laughs> Put a counter on <laughs> Kithian at the start of combat. Mm -hmm. Game life. I, don't like that. I, can't I really do, do like anything it. about that at the moment. I will pass turn. <laughs> Draw. Eight. something against them. <laughs> I mean, almost every card in there I is know. like a card that's just KOS. It, it, like, yeah, I know, I know. This whole deck is KOS. Like, to be fair, it's part of the reason I love it so much. So, yes, to go down 16. Okay. Extraction special. Um, yeah, so three mana. Extraction Specialist, bringing back a Lieutenant. How is that a card? I don't know. <laughs> like, <laughs> it's three mana to get five mana worth of stuff. And, and not only that, it's like, hey, this creature's not a threat, but it is still getting stuff in the right. background. Right, um, So, uh, do the ETB, he, Extraction Specialist will also get a 1-1 one -one counter. He is now a 5-4 uh, and a 3-3. Three -three. Yeah. Uh, I can't swing with three, so I'm just going to swing with Kithian. And it's a 5-4. Five 5-4. Four. Five four. Uh, with his abilities. Uh, he won't get the top trigger, but he, I do have three mana. Right. No blocks. Okay. Go to three. Faster. Draw. Um, it's not a May. I messed up my math. I only gave him the 1-1 one -one counter for Thalia's Lieutenant entering the battlefield for its trigger, not for the other two humans entering the battlefield. This is actually a 5-5. Five -five. Okay. Because it was a human ETB. She had one. Also, ETB. it's not a May isn't a thing, by the way. Isn't? It's not a thing. I mean, okay. I'll give you your triggers. Oh, you it, it, you it, acknowledge them. Okay, you okay. acknowledge them. I'll give them to you. Okay. Um, but like, that's not a thing. Okay. Like, I was always told that it was it, if it's not a main no, and you no, can go so, back and do it, you uh, do. But. Yeah, but I can always say, oh well, I would have done something on your end step if I knew that was a five five, and then you can. Yeah, that's fair. Um, that's fair. But fair. yeah, so like for the video, I'm gonna give him his triggers because it's regular REL and he acknowledged them. Yeah. Um, but like, in a in a tournament scenario, doesn't matter what regular REL comp REL, mm. if it's a miss trigger. 
there is no such thing as a may or not ability. Now, if it's detrimental, is different. Yeah. Okay. Um, and then also, if it's like a packed trigger, there's a default action okay. associated with some triggers. Like if it's a scry, and I miss a scry. It's assumed I left it on top. Mm. Um, so like, yeah. That's oh, yeah, one thing that drives me crazy is people saying it's a may ability. Or it's not a may ability. I, there, I think there's a, 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 an actual like, magic ruling where that came up. But it probably was a detrimental effect. Detrimentals uh, always go on the stack once they're acknowledged. Um, and there's a warning issued. If a beneficial is acknowledged later, the opponent gets to choose if it goes okay. on the stack. And so, like, Dark Confidant is the biggest example. Like, is it beneficial or detrimental? Because yeah. you lose life. But it's always beneficial because, one, you play it because you want that ability. You want right. to draw the extra card. But the the reason that the solution is up to the opponent is, if I'm at 20 and I miss it, you're probably not going to give it to me. Yeah. If I'm at 1 and I miss it, oh, you're, you're going to give it to you're me. You're killing me. Yeah. <laughs> um, I think you have this game. I, I, I kind of felt like that was also where it was. That's why I was okay with it being yeah. two as well. Yeah. I'm like, I, I don't think it's going to... I'm going to do that and pass. All right. um, so, but yeah, may abilities aren't actually a thing in the rules. Okay. So like, There are things you can't skip. Like, I can't let you forget to draw a card or right, untap. Because right, right, right. that's a that's an actual a game action. Yeah. yeah. Um, but like, I don't have to remember your triggers for you. I don't have right. to win the game for you. Um, so, and he's prototyped, yeah? He is prototyped, yeah, sorry. No, no, that's fine. I, I just, I was looking at your man. Yeah, like, if you have Brave, you're good. Uh, that's, yeah, that's the fun bit. Um, make a human. Mm -hmm. uh, gets a counter. Yep. Gets a counter. Uh, yeah, gets a counter as well. And flunge. I'll remind you, you triggered the time. Mostly because I don't know what your cards do. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Um, so... He can't attack, he's sick. He can't attack because he's under him. Uh, and, yes. Yay. Because I haven't cast it, it's probably pretty clear to have Brave. Right. Okay, so what's... That's a 5-4 still, and this is a 6-6? Six, six. Yes. Yep. <laughs> that's basically the choice. You can... Yeah. I want to read this. Yeah. Uh, he turns into like the end of combat. Uh, okay. Yeah, so if he lives. Right. So if he lives, even if you kill Father's Lieutenant, he will flip. Right. Yeah, and again, yeah. it's like because it's if you attacked with three, so if you had like one him and the Adeline, an Adeline it wouldn't trigger. Because the. Oh, it's two. Yeah, it's two others. So like yep. because the others weren't declared as an attacker. Yeah. That's the weird part about it. Um, magic, magic see, wording. The, in my mind, I, I see it with this one because it, he's tempers. He's not, oh yes, yeah, sir. Uh, he's not visual. I, I I see it with this one because in me it looked it would uh, look at it being common. It does check at the end of combat, so you gotta make sense. Yeah. Um, I think I'm forced to do this. Okay. Uh, so I'm gonna gain three to eight. Yep. And I'm gonna take four. Okay, yeah, and I will gain four. So I'm gonna four. Also, on that note, uh, I did miss my shoulder trigger thing at the beginning of oh, the turn. Oh yeah. So I'm at eighteen. Okay, yeah. So we're just kind of like at discussion mode at this point. <laughs> and then this dot, uh, everything dies. Well, well that he lives. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but he lives. Yes. And he lives because he got three. Yep. Uh, and I'm at four turned. and you're at 18. Yep. Okay. You're good. <laughs> My mana's just been off. I've been one mana off oh, every single turn from being able to cast something with that. I see. Um... Oh, hey, another one. Yeah, but like, last turn, I could have cast this and this if I had six lands. This turn, I can cast this and this if I had six lands. Or seven lands. Yeah. Uh, pass. Uh, I will lose two as I draw. Yep. 16. I think you've got it, though. Because you've got four there, and I can block this. Right, and I, I mean, uh, he's a human as yeah. well, and yeah, just as a, a good measure, land for turn, pump. blow it up to yeah. pop him as well. Yeah, good games. Good games. Oh. Fist bump. Yeah, go 